years ago, the rich culture and legacy of Kashmir was erased. The invaders of this country rewrote the history, leaving behind a lie for the generations to come. But the truth never dies. As Kashmir's historical book Raja Tarangini recounts, from the inception, Nagas prospered in the underwaters of Lake Satisaras. Troubled by a gigantic demon Jalobhav once, the Naga king Neela seeked his father, the Tejasvi, Rishi Kashyap's help. Rishi Kashyap drained out the lake Satisaras by opening a hole in the hill near Varamula, leaving Jalobhav powerless. So Lord Vishnu seized the opportunity and killed him. To honor Rishi Kashyap's brave feat, Lord Vishnu renamed Satidesha as Kashyapami, meaning the lake or mountain of Kashyap. Over time, Varamula came to be known as Baramulla and Kashyapamir as Kashmir. However, along with history, the golden heritage of this Manasputra has also vanished in time. Chosen by Lord Brahma to bring this world alive, he was the first Saptarushi of this Manavantara. He painted the canvas of three worlds with beautiful creatures and therefore the earth was also called Kashyapi. Adept at using Yagyas to harmonize nature, Rishi Kashyap was the presiding priest who performed the Ashwamedha Yagya for Lord Parashuram who killed 20 generations of Kshatriyas. In return, Rishi Kashyap asked for the entire world won by Parashuram, thus saving the universe from his anger forever. He was the seer of many hymns of the Rig Veda. He wrote about the principles of Dharma in Kashyapa Dharma Sutra, signs of birth, pediatrics and gynecology inscribed in the Kashyapa Samhita. He saved us time and again and yet we have forgotten him and the dharma he taught us. It's time to revive the flame of Sanatana Dharma and bring back the glory of our eternal Vedas. Join hands with sadhana to revive what's lost. Let's reunite with our dharma.